Happy New Year, Boss family. It's Janelle here from the prayer team. I'm here to talk to you about our 40 day fast for 2022. So the fast, the 40 day fast is going to start January 1st and it's going to end on February 9th. Um, today, I'm here to talk to you about day one of the fast, um, actually the first week of the fast. The theme of the first week of the fast is just going to be introduction to our specific fast and then the basics of fasting. But day one, I'm just going to go over an overview. So the theme of our fast for 2022 is deep calls to deep. And that's based off the scripture, Psalms 42, verse 7, which reads, Deep calls into deep. At the noise of your waterfall, all your waves and pillows have gone over me. Um, I love the Passion Translation, so I'm going to read part A um, of the Passion Translation for Psalms 42, verse 7, which reads, My deep need calls out to the deep kindness of your love. And so just a little background about Psalms 42. Um, David gives us a poetic description of his unbearable suffering that he's going through in the specific circumstances at that time. Um, he's, his world has been thrown into such an intense turmoil um, that his enemies taught him continually asking, where is your God? Your God is so great, but where is he? So out of that deep turmoil uh, comes his Psalms in 42 verse 7. It says where he's saying, my deep is calling, my deep need is calling out um, for your deepness, for my need to be fulfilled. So he's expressing his his um, um, just the deepness that he needs in his soul um, to be fulfilled from God. I want to read you an excerpt or a commentary specifically for Psalms 42 verse 7. So it says, which is explaining Psalms 42 verse 7 in more in depth. So it says, the deep of man's need calls unto the deep of God's fullness. And the deep of God's fullness calls unto the deep of man's need. Between our emptiness and his all-sufficiency, there is a great gulf. But deep is calling unto deep. The deep mercy of God's of, of God, the deep mercy of God needs our emptiness, into which it might pour itself out. Nothing can fully meet the depth of our need, but the depth of his almighty fullness. So I want you to just focus on that for day one, Psalms 42, verse 7. And that's going to be our theme um, over the next five weeks. I'll have different prayer focuses, but I just want you to remember um, the focus for this fast is to deepen our relationship with God. No matter where we're at, whether we're new believers, we don't know what fasting is, we're fasting for the first time, or we're seasoned and we've been you know, in church for a long time, there's always a depth to God. And I hear uh, prophetically just calling us as a congregation, us corporately as we fast, to pray for this deepness with Him. Intimacy with God, you can take anywhere with you. No matter who's in your life, who's not in your life, which church you're at, which job you're at, it's your relationship with God is that, that in which, that's going to sustain you through any circumstances. And so the more deep you are, the more rooted you are, um, the more closer you'll be with God. Um, and, and, and you'll have an abundant life in which we know in the scripture that he talks about. Um, so that's the first part. The next one, I just wanted to go briefly over um, the, the weekly theme. So week one, um, like I said, is going to be the basics of fasting and what a, a deep, into, intimate relationship with God looks like. Um, the next week is going to be identity and the character of God. Um, we can't have a deep relationship with someone we're not aware of. And I'm praying that God is going to reveal himself through um, this fast and through the second week as well. The next week is going to be our identity as a son and daughter. Now that we know who God is, who are we um, through Christ? Who are we as a son and daughter? And um, and how does that equip us to, to live out our purpose? How does that equip us to, to um, live out the call um, in God's kingdom that he's calling us to? And then the last week, we're going to be focusing now, you know, now that we, you know, we focus on who God is. Now we focus, we did another focus on who we are um, and our purpose. We're going to start to actually activate that and begin to pray and intercede for specific areas over our church corporately. I'm excited for this new year. So this is day one of um, our fast and thank you guys.